logs were heavy. And he grew weaker as time went. And one day, he threw down the logs as he could no longer bear their weight. And he, he called for death to come to him. And when death arrived, He's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of you. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from her taste in men, of course. She was a special woman. She wanted to protect people. She was here. She saw every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us, watching over us. Leading us home? Does my request upset you? Death is a natural part of life, my love. I wish only to be prepared for when my time comes. We mortals must do such things. I am glad to have you prepare with me. You are quiet? I have nothing to say. Well, say something. I enjoy hearing your voice. different. Oh? Mm. In my land, we entomb our loved ones. You would have me trapped in the ground for eternity. I would have you close to me. How touching. My rotting corpse would bring you such comfort. <laughs> you once tried to take charge of your ending, did you know? That was different. Circumstance, yes. But not on purpose. You 
prepare for a distant future. There is much time ahead of us. I wish to better a future that will exist without me. Whenever that day comes, for you and for our son. You will always walk together, Kratos. You will always be a part of me. I will always be a part of you. And when you are gone, that part of me dies as well. See, do you feel your absence? <laughs> Culmination of love is grief. And yet we love, despite the inevitable. We open our hearts to it. When the pyre is spent, and you have gathered my ashes, spread them from the highest peak in all the realms. You will do this for me. is to have loved fully. Open your heart to the world as you have opened it to me and you will find every reason to keep living in it. What's going on? It is time. I'll meet you outside, Father. Sir. you one more time, my queen. Me too. But not as your queen. As sisters. Are you ready? Yes. I will be your general. It will be an honor to fight alongside you, general. Aye, brother. I'll be right by your side. So, what are your orders? To the temple.
want before you go to war. Ah, what was I thinking? Of course you got your armor all set. Just go win. That's all that matters. Prepare to be very impressed. Admit you just came to see me. Oh, do you think it wise to go off without stocking up? You may never get a chance again. I'm so sorry that was dark. Hey there, I uh made some armor for storming Asgard and, and whatnot. I thought you could make use of it. Indeed. Shopper. General. Sir? General? General? Sir. Hey, bud. Uh, General. Prophecy did not lead us here, nor will it win this battle. Wars are won by those that are willing to sacrifice everything. If that is the cost of vengeance, so be it. Odin has taken so much from us already. The realms have suffered. Enough! No matter the cost. This ends... today. And going out in a blaze of glory means that Odin burns too? And that's where I'll be. A big, fat smile on my face. For Brock.
Muspelheim Tower has fallen. And if Odin goes after Niflheim next... They're trying to shut out Ragnarok. We've got to stop those war machines. Not an ideal start. Work to do. You three, follow them. Atreus, Freya, with me. Watch our flights. To the war machines. Odin's new Valkyrie Queen is phenomenal. I would think so. Then we must hurry. Incoming behind ah. your brother! This way! 
Up here! Norman Gander! A welcome sight! But he didn't follow us from Midgard! Curious! He'll keep Thor busy at least! Focus up! Giant Giants made it after all. The snake looks different. He is different. But when I was away, uh, uh, never mind, later. The Ain Herjar's link to Valhalla. My sisters and I must sever it. Go. Still no sign of the dwarves. Sindri won't let us down. We have to trust him. Hmm. Rally all you can. We will make for this fun of Huntawa. I'm late. Where is your army? No more dwarves are dying for this. Sid, we... Save it! Odin forced them to build those war machines. And I'm here to tear them down. Before you break them, we must turn them on the wall. Fine. Leave it to the dwarves to clean up after the giants. <laughs> Yeah. 
just what you wanted. I, I didn't want this. No. Close your heart to it. Close your heart. Who are they? My guardians. Odin took them in. They shouldn't be here. They're not soldiers. Odin put them in our path to die. It's war. Wars are won. By those who are willing to sacrifice. Everything. What are you doing? Son, listen closely. You feel their pain because that is who you are. And you must never sacrifice that. Never. Not for anyone. I was wrong, Atreus. I was wrong. Open your heart. Open your heart to their suffering. That is your mother's wish. And mine as well. Today, sir. Today, we will be better. But what can we do? See the size of that thing? I think we're gonna win. I mean, if they don't kill us first. Why have you stopped? Ragnarok is here. We finally have Odin right where we... We will stop Odin. But we did not come to sacrifice the innocent. We will breach the wall at Hrimthor's flaw. With what army? Atreus and I will be enough. That's suicide. It may be. But we will die seeking justice, not vengeance. Can that weapon break open the flaw? Only one way to find out. You three. Get those people to safety wherever you can find it. We will see if done. Frey and I will do what we can to slow Ragnarok. He was not mindless before. See if he will listen to reason. <laughs> Odin will not get away. If he does, so help me. I know. Valky! Ah! No! No! Protect him! I will help those that are trapped and meet you at the fall. Go! Go, Atreus! 